tonight, man. I gotta imagine you're feeling pretty good, but, but what did you think about how, how you fought tonight? Uh, I thought that was exactly what we envisioned. I knew I was gonna get the takedowns. I knew I was a better wrestler. I knew I had the better endurance. Uh, I thought maybe I'd use my, my striking a little bit more, but once I felt how easy it was to get him on his back, I I made a, a quick adjustment in my head, like, why even play with him? He's ranked below me. I can't risk getting, getting dropped again. Excuse me. Getting dropped again hurts. So I just took him down and grinded pounded him out. You, I mean, you used the word easy there. I know no fight's easy, you know, they're tough guys, but I mean, did you in your head at all think that you could be that dominant tonight? Absolutely. Uh, I'm very, very strong. Uh, I'm a very, very good wrestler. I just, I knew once I get behind your kneecaps, there's not a whole lot you can do. And I was getting there pretty easily. And then, even, even though he got up the one time, that's because I, I let him up, you know? We've had a couple of setbacks along the way, but I feel like this is a big statement. There's not a lot of names in front of you on the list. I mean, give you an idea of where you think you are in the division and what you deserve right now. I think it's only the only guy that's logical is uh, Junior. They're not going to give me DC. They're not going to give me Stipe or Ngannou. Junior's ranked right above me. It makes sense. And there's no disrespect to him. I don't think he's like the easiest out of the guys ranked above me. It's just he's the most most logical one. I think I do the same thing to him that I've done to everybody else. I will take him down. I will ground him down. Yeah, I mean, uh, of course it does. Before it's like, oh, if you lose, it's, it hurts to lose regardless, but it, it only affects me. Now me losing, me bringing home half a paycheck, that's no good for my daughter. I can't, I can't have that. Um, I really didn't explore too much. I'm like a head case uh, during my fight week. I barely leave the whole hotel. I just. I sleep most of the time, but now that the fight's over, I'm going to explore, I'm going to go enjoy myself. I don't plan on, I won't be out of the country until uh, Tuesday afternoon, so I got tonight, Sunday, and all of uh, Monday to explore. Yeah, uh, it was from uh, Colorado to Munich, Germany was eight hours, well, eight and a half hours, and then from Germany to here was about six and a half, so but I'm used to these, like, I've been to Australia, that there's nothing, you can't beat that, so anything else is a piece of cake. The, the heat doesn't affect me, the crowd doesn't affect me, if anything affects you in the cage, you're not ready to fight, so nothing affects me in the cage. I don't really have a timeline um, before my birthday. My birthday is in February, so December, January, somewhere around there. It didn't affect me at all. I don't even remember how hot it was. It doesn't affect me. Where? I, I'm not going to Russia. No. No. I'm just not going to Russia. It's not going to Russia. No.